Hi guys, Wing Merchant here, and I've just bought Duke Nukem the other day for three pounds from a game store, and I was just going to give you my initial thoughts. Now, reviewers gave this a fairly low score. I think IGN gave it a 5.5 .5 out of 10 and said it was mediocre. Uh, I disagree somewhat so far from what I've played. Uh, this game is graphically not great. But the gameplay is reasonably fun. I've uh, enjoyed the little mini games that have been thrown in so far, like uh, driving around in a remote control car being Mini Duke, as I am now, and uh, playing pinball machines and uh, lifting weights, etc. I quite enjoy the interactive environments and interactive stuff they've put into Boosher Ego. And to be honest, although not a great game, this is definitely a game worth playing. This game is fun, it's stupid, and it's just insane so far from what I've played the boss monsters are absolutely awesome they're huge scary beasts and it does bring back some nostalgia from old PS1 games and PS2 games and that uh, gives it that sort of arcadey classic -y feel now a lot of people hated the graphics like I said the graphics aren't great but they're certainly better than some games that are out today um, that's all I can pretty much say about the graphics, you know, they're, uh, they could have been up a little bit, but they're reasonably okay, and like I say, they're better than some games, so I don't know what people are complaining about. Duke Nukem is a pretty fun game. It's basically a first-person shooter with attitude, and Duke, as always, is a complete and utter asshole in the fact that he's just so full of himself, you know, as he's always been. He's just extremely up his own ass, but it makes for an extremely pleasant and funny experience and people said the level designs were rubbish I don't think the level designs are that bad and the platforming areas are actually quite fun especially like I said when you get to be mini duke uh, it's it's pretty funny and there's a lot of puns and a lot of charm and wit and Duke definitely gives off that sort of classic 90s 1980s 1990s arrogant sort of vibe and he fulfills his his own role in that now I will be giving a review once I finish the game but I just wanted to say if you no one's if you guys haven't played it yet or you haven't picked it up um, and you're basing it on IGM reviews and other reviews then don't pick up the game it's really really cheap and you'll actually find it's quite a fun experience to run through and it's just something different there's a lot of first person shooters out there trying to be serious all the time whereas this is just taking the piss out of practically everything and it does it really really well so I definitely recommend picking this game up and I'll be doing a review on it at a later date. Anyway guys, I hope you liked the video. As always, like, comment and subscribe. And check out my website. And uh, I'll see you next time. Cheers. I could carry you around in my pocket like a little pet. Your hot pocket. <laughs> oh, that's funny. Size only matters when you're full grown, baby.